a happy Halloween. Today is Halloween, and this is my Halloween blog. And today, my Halloween blog is my costume. I'm going out as a bum. That's why I look like this. Haven't shaved in three days. I'm going to be a bum. I figure it's cheaper to look like this than to go out and buy a bum costume. Actually, I look, look like this every day. Actually, it's Halloween for me every day. But uh, speaking about a bum, that's why I'm looking like this. My hair's all disheveled. Uh, every day I'm... <laughs> anyway, um... I remember being in Las Vegas, and I saw a bum in Las Vegas standing at a street corner, and he was standing in front of a parking meter. The bum was standing in front of a parking meter, and he was putting in quarters, turning the dial, putting in quarters, turning the dial. I said, what are you doing that for? This isn't a slot machine. It's a parking meter. He said, I know, but I like the odds, nine to five. <laughs> so happy Halloween. It's Halloween. It's October 31st, and it's Monday night, and it's Halloween, and happy Halloween. It's my Halloween blog. I, I love to take the kids out for Halloween. I took them out every year. Lauren was a little boy. We, we had a, a fireman's hat on. We took him up to my in-law's place to, for Halloween. He was one, one years old. And then we went to every year to Halloween with his friends around the neighborhood. It was a lot of fun. And now they're too old. Nobody wants to go out for Halloween. I still want to go out for Halloween. I remember being a kid going out for Halloween. When I was a kid, I used to make movies in my house. And I had premieres. And I had a Halloween premiere. And all my friends came dressed up as Groucho Marx and as... Um, uh, uh, I can't think what the hell else I got dressed up, but I have all these movies I have to send to my friends in Philadelphia. I've been telling them, they've been asking me, Dave, send us the movies. We were in high school, I have movies. When I made it as a kid, I was like this, Steven Spielberg. I'm still Steven Spielberg. And uh, but now I do it for real. And uh, I, I got to send them the movies I made. I had premieres. My, my friends had a ball in my house uh, making movies and stuff, but I got to send them those movies. But it's Halloween, and now my kids don't want to go out. I want to go out. Nobody else wants to go out. We kind of. Who's going to go out with me? Grossman. Grossman, you'll go out with me for Halloween? Oh, terrific. Grossman's going to go out with me for Halloween. Um, but uh, I remember one Halloween, uh, I, I went, my wife was feeling a little uh, amorous, if that's the word. So we checked into a, a hotel for Halloween night, and the, the, the room next to us, the walls were so thin. And I remember the room next to us, there was a couple in there, and the girl in there must have had a terrible sweet tooth, a terrible sweet tooth. Because all night long she was hollering, Oh, Henry! Oh, Henry! Oh, Henry! <laughs> Alright, happy Halloween! We have a pumpkin, we have a jack-o'-lantern. I'm gonna go down to the pumpkin patch because I heard that every Halloween that the great pumpkin comes out and gives you toys to all the boys and girls. I go every year and I never see nothing. So I'm going out now with uh, with uh, Charlie Brown. Uh, wait, I, all I got is a rock. And I'm gonna go to it. I watched it this year too. My kids didn't watch it with me. I watched it this year. I watch it every year. The great pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Uh, I'm, still like, I'm still the same kid I was in Philadelphia. As I always tell my kids growing up that... Uh, Adults or children, we just look older. Most of us. <laughs> Other ones really were born old. <laughs> like some of my teachers. Like some of my kids' teachers. I'll never figure that part out. But I'm still the same kid in Philadelphia at Farrell High School. High School. Farrell Elementary School. At Northeast High School. Where my school now, I heard, has metal detectors. I don't even want to talk about it. But, and I, I heard they have, there's, there's uh, who the hell cares. Anyway, uh, I'm still the same kid in Northeast Philadelphia. I still want to go out with, with my trick-or-treat bag. And I still want to get candy, but American candy. Because here... My trick, my trick or treat bag somewhere in the basement, probably with the same candy from 1976. But, uh, but, but the Canadian candy is different than the American candy. I like American candy, American Hershey bars and Mounds and Almond Joy. Uh, the they have, they have caramel here and some other bullshit candy. I don't know what the it's it's terrible candy here. I don't like the candy here. You didn't grow up with it. I didn't grow up with it, but I grew up with American candy. In fact, um, I never grew up. I never grew up. My uh, my wife feeding me all the lines. I went out with a girl named uh, Candy. Uh, I went out with a girl named Hershey. What the hell's the joke? I went out with a girl named Candy. What happened? I went out with a girl named Candy. What happened? What happened? She made your feet up, brittle. <laughs> this is the joke. I went out with a girl named Candy. She made my peanut brittle. <laughs> why? Why can't I remember my own jokes, my own lines? That's a funny joke. That's how my wife's here. I went out with a girl named Hershey because she was half nuts. Anyway, go to David Pro go to David Bronstein <laughs> What the hell was that? Try the veal. The next show's at 2 o'clock. Uh, go to BronsteinTV.com. BronsteinTV.com. Where you can see more of my crazy Catskill jokes, funny blogs, and the hottest TV products like golf clubs and, and toothpicks. I got the hottest new product. It's called Flavored Toothpicks. I don't know what the hell they're called. But they're toothpicks, and they can help you curb smoking. They, 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 they taste good. They're toothpicks. They're flavored toothpicks. And you can find them at, uh, um, where the hell can you? BronsteinTV.com. Go to BronsteinTV.com for the hottest TV products and crazy blogs and hot broads. BronsteinTV.com. Goodbye. Happy